We're here today at uh, Ehovi, and they have brought together roughly 20 educators from 12 area schools to add to their curriculum in STEM. In particular, they are building a local area drone racing league. We saw a group of schools, Northern Ohio, come together for the first time to do drone racing. I think the opportunities that we're creating today for them for the future may lead to jobs uh, that they never thought they could have. Uh, and so with that, um, this is the wave of the future um, and it's only gonna get bigger. And uh, we're at the foundation of this and we're gonna grow it together. Part of my job is to try to help uh, find uh, innovative ways to, to help train and teach kids. And um, the one thing that has been uh, on our mind is drone racing. And um, I, I think, you know, you look in the news today and how our, our, our world is changing. And I think we need to start having our kids look at um, the world that they're going to live in in the future and what it is that they can uh, do to, to adapt and to be ready for that future. I've been involved in safety third racing and drone racing at a hobby level for a couple years now, but this is the first time that we've had a chance to work with schools uh, to start drone racing in schools. Everybody that's been here is going to take a lot of learning, a lot of familiarity with STEM technology, STEM learning, drone racing, drone technology, all of that back to their schools, back to their school districts where kids can participate in another facet of learning about uh, uh, technology. Buckeye is a technology company. That's what we do. We provide bandwidth and connectivity. The people who go through these sorts of, of programs make the best uh, employees for us and, and we want to encourage uh, STEM, STEM learning, uh, higher education, more educational opportunities in every school for every kid. I got really excited today. So if an old guy like me with 34 years of uh, experience under his belt it gets excited about this, you can imagine how our students are going to feel about that. This is an outstanding opportunity for our kids and we can combine this right with our design lab to create drones, to expand the program, um, give the kids an opportunity to design and create uh, as they're going along and then race and compete. I think that our kids at school are going to be really excited about this and we're going to try and use it as a way to get more kids involved that might not realize that they have an interest in tech. This will be this will be great to get the other schools in and set up competitively. Everybody wants to win something and do something. I think this is going to be a great program for our area. I think it gives them an opportunity to look at a career that's possibly in their future. I think that like drone building and repairing and looking at that, um, you know, that career path is something that we can maybe introduce them to at the junior high and high school level. And I think our like standards for science um, and technology are perfectly addressed with this type of activity. That's a great opportunity for the for the youngsters um, and especially for us we have just uh, we've just through the generosity of benefactor created a STEM integration lab. So we had this wonderful space and we were sort of searching around for things to do and this this opportunity was presented to me and I was like gee what what a great what a great program for our kids to get involved in. I'm really looking forward to this first racing season and being a part of it. If you're a school, a high school, middle school, uh, even a community center, and, and you're looking to get into drone racing, this is an exciting time. Uh, the technology that goes into drone racing is finally coming down in price. It's becoming more accessible. The race management software, uh, even the general awareness and, and skill of, of people in, in your communities is, is finally getting to this critical mass. It is an almost costless way to expand the curriculum in a critical area, in a critical field of, of technology. And by costless, these four inch drones, a, a kit to build a four inch drone is less than a few hundred dollars. You can have a team together at your school for less than a few hundred dollars. With our collaboration with everybody here, um, we're building a foundation that I think is gonna grow into something amazing. And so I can't wait to see it.